Hey guys, what's up? John and Steph here from FlyMikeAlpha.com. We're going to take you through how to depart from a Class D airport today. So first thing is, we got our airplane fired up. We're at the ramp at the FBO. We're going to go ahead and get the ATIS. Wind zero one zero at seven. Visibility one zero. Sky clear. Temperature one six. Dew point four. Altimeter three zero one five. Visual approach runway four in use. Advise on initial contact. You have Sierra. Tire information Sierra time one six four eight Zulu weather. Wind zero one zero at seven. Visibility one zero. Sky clear. Temperature one six. Dew point four. Altimeter three zero one five. Visual approach runway. Four. Okay, so we've got our ATIS, Sierra, we've got our alternator set, runway four. we've done our after start checklist, we're all set. We'll four go ahead and let them know that front of the ground, or 8786 Echo, is that the FBO? With Sierra, BFR Defense. You could even say we're ready to, we are dialed up on ground, yep. And you could even say uh, we're ready to taxi VFR to Venice, so. Roger. Puna to ground, 8786 Echo at the FBO, ready to taxi with Sierra, VFR to Venice. Try it again. Yeah. Puna to ground, say again. 8786 Echo, ready to taxi from the FBO with Sierra, VFR to Venice. 76 Echo, information tangos on the air now, runway 4, taxi via Delta. Taxi via Delta, and we will get the current ATIS, 86 Echo. All right, so we got information tango now, parking brake off will help, okay. and your feet are on the brakes. Yes, I know. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and so, runway 4 via Delta, we'll go ahead, we'll pull our, our taxi diagram just to make sure we're going the right way, and runway 4 via Delta. Okay. And runway four is right there. So, awesome job. Only thing that I would say is just make sure you include which runway you're going to since there's multiple ones here. Okay. When you read it back. Now, when can we switch over from ground to tower? On the whole trip line? Yeah, basically once we get up to the runway there. Whenever you get, there's no set distance, but when you get close enough to the whole short line or when you're actually sitting there holding short, then you'll go ahead and switch over to tower. You're clear on the right. Okay. Pentagon to ground, Aero 3745, Quebec, clear the active. 45, Quebec, Pentagon to ground, Roger, you can taxi the FBO via taxiway Charlie and Delta, cross runway 33 at Charlie. Charlie and Delta, cross runway 33 at Charlie, Quebec, Quebec. We taxi just a little slower. Self service yeah, so fuel, we can see the enhanced uh, taxi line here, so we can actually start stopping here short, a little five, further, short of the whole short line. I'd like to stop about what aircraft we have behind, make a right so. Turn on to Delta. We'll left at Golf. Left on runway three, three, down here, and we can go ahead and run through our pre-takeoff checklist. Yeah, I'm sorry, man, I missed that. Give me that again. Right, left. Left, right. You're going out right on Delta. Left and on Golf. Runway so run three up. down to Our flight instruments are checking set. Fuel is on the full tank right section. Delta, we'll go ahead and check that our suction gauge is good. It is. Runway three three at our controls are being correct. You can go ahead and do a flight control check. Sure. Crossing three three. Uh, Charlie to Delta to the MPO. We'll talk about it. We can go ahead and we can switch our radio now over to Tower. So we'll switch over to COM2 and listen to COM2. And we'll go ahead and let Tower know that we are ready to depart runway 4 at Delta, VFR to Venice. Point to to ground, 8786 Echo, ready to depart runway 4, VFR to Venice at Delta. And we're talking about six echo Pentagon to tower. Runway four cleared for takeoff. Wind three three zero at five. Left turnout is approved and no delay on your roll. Eight six echo, clear for takeoff runway four, left turnout approved. Alrighty. Uh flaps? Uh no flaps or takeoff. We take okay. off zero flaps in this airplane. Okay. Very good. Just tower now we're talking to. Tower. Yep. What did I say? 
You said ground. That's okay. Ground. We're lining up. We'll go ahead and turn our light and fuel pump on. You got plenty of time. A little bit of left crosswind, so we'll keep that left aileron down to start with. Wait till you get lined up on that center line before you apply full power. Okay. And there we go. Tower, good afternoon, Legion 16, uh, 69, All with the you to on the visual approach, runway 4. And 16, power 16, set, engines are green, up, airspeed's alive. Off, two number three for the runway. A little less left aileron okay, now we'll as you speed up. Uh, number three. 16, and 69. let's rotate. Pull back, pull back, Deep pull Gulf, back, Bravo, pull back. Uh, the Cessna you're following is just ahead and to your left on about a mile we'll left base. climb out at VY, right around 90. I appreciate there. it. We're looking for him. Oh, I just picked him up. Thank you. We're number two. Deep Gulf, Bravo, number two, cleared to land, All runway right. four, wind 330 at six. Roger that, and a full stop, we'll expedite. November 51166, uh, turn left and enter the right downwind for runway four. You're and following your bus we'll traffic, left uh, turn. six miles left turn, we'll take that left of the airfield. Oh, about a heading of 300. Do we have to wait until we're past the end of the runway? Uh, you don't actually have to wait until you're past the end of the runway. As long as you have that altitude, you can go ahead and start making your turn. Okay. If it was conflicting with any other traffic in the pattern for different runways, I would probably wait. But there's nothing that says you have to wait till the end of the runway. Well, guys, that's the quick and easy version of how to depart a class Delta airport. If you have any questions on that at all, leave them in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to get back to you. Be sure to check out our class Delta section on our private pilot ground school that has lots more class D airport videos of arriving and departing into a class Delta airport. As always, guys, make sure you check out our Patreon page. Give us a thumbs up, like, and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can keep up with our latest videos. Check out all the awesome courses we have available online at fly8mikealpha.com. And as always, guys, if you can't fly every day, then fly8mikealpha.com. We will see you all next time.